A rectangular box with open top is to be formed from a rectangular piece of cardboard which is 3 inches by 8 inches. What size square should be cut from each corner to form the box with maximum volume? The quantity that we need to optimize for this problem is the volume. Kailangan ma-maximize natin siya. So meron tayong isang cardboard na ang dimensions ay 3 inches by 8 inches. Tapos magkakat tayo from each corner ng square para pag pinold natin siya, makagawa tayo ng box. So, hindi natin alam yung dimension na yun na ikakat natin. Tawagin natin x from each corner. Tawagin natin siyang x. Then, kapag pinold natin siya, imagine, ganito yung magiging itsura ng ating box. So, ano ba yung magiging dimension ng box natin? Looking at this figure, so, itong part na to, ito yung magiging length niya. Pag tinignan nyo, that is equal to 8 minus 2x. Ito yon. Then, the width, this part, is equal to this. And that is equal to 3 minus yung dalawang x na ibabawas natin or yung sa square na ikakat. So, that will be the width. Ano yung magiging height ng ating box? So, pag pinode natin yan, ito, that will be the height. Sulat tayo ngayon ng function for the volume na minamaximize or ino-optimize natin. The volume is equal to the product of the length, 8 minus 2x, the width, 3 minus 2x, and the height na x. Meron na tayong function dito and notice na siya ay reduce na into one variable which is x. So, pwede na natin siyang i-differentiate. Pag di-differentiate natin to, we'll have the product of three terms na medyo mahaba kapag ginawa natin. Kaya multiply na lang muna natin yung second and third since madali lang naman siyang i-multiply. So, 8 minus 2x multiplied by 3x minus 2x squared. So, differentiate na natin to using product rule. Derivative of v with respect to x is equal to first term times the derivative of the second term 3 minus 4x plus the second term 3x minus 2x squared times the derivative of the first term. So, derivative ng 8 is 0. Minus derivative ng 2x is 2. Simplify natin. Derivative of v with respect to x equals distribute natin using FOIL method. So, 8 times 3 is 24. Minus 2x times 3 6x minus 4x times 8 is negative 32x negative 2x times negative 4x is positive 8x squared plus 3x times negative 2 negative 2x squared times negative 2 is positive 4x squared simplify ulit natin to then, equate natin sa 0. So, 0 equals 24 minus negative 38 minus 6, negative 44x. 8x squared plus 4x squared is 12x squared. So, notice na common factor si 4. Factor out natin and we'll have 6 minus 11x plus 3x squared dividing both sides by 4 0 equals sulat ko lang to na nauuna yung highest power 3x squared minus 11x plus 6 is equal to 0 factoring this out and we can get 3x minus 2 times x minus 3 
and we can solve for the value of x as 2 over 3 and 3. Meron tayong dalawang value ng x, which is 2 thirds and 3. Kapag ginamit natin si 3, so palit natin dito, ano, negative 2 times 3. So, imposible na yung value ng x is 3. Kaya, ang gagamitin natin is x equals 2 thirds.